So one of the big problems that you get with these kind of mountains of huge amounts of telemetry, uh, such as, uh, say, Bro data here. Uh, yeah, Bro uh, is a deep packet inspection tool, and what this is doing is producing quite large amounts of data. In this instance, uh, we're looking at getting a raw tap of the network and getting all of the HTTP and uh, a few other types of data off of this as well. So to actually be able to make sense of this and investigate it, we're going to have to pivot and slice and dice this a little bit. So this is what these uh, grouping capabilities at the top of the interface allow you to do. So instead of looking at this view, I might want to pivot into something like the destination address view. So what this is going to show me is now all of those alerts grouped for an individual host. Uh, I can also then uh, provide subgroups of that. So if I have a look at, say, the country that's been enriched against those, then I can see, uh, you yeah, know, this way around, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense, right? Because most IP addresses are only going to come from one country. Uh, if you have, uh, yeah, you, uh, it is possible to get multiple countries per IP address, but that's usually because things have changed and your data is not, uh, your enrichment data is uh, needs updating. Uh, so let's have a look at this the other way around. What we can do is drag this round and resort the order of these groupings. Uh, so we've now got something a little bit more sensible. So now let's look at, um, you know, we always pick on Russia, so let's pick on France here for, uh, for once. And you can now see all the IP destinations uh, which are under France there. And I can drill down into those specific bro items for uh, just that host. So it's quite good for being able to start from uh, you know, quite a high level uh, and grouping, and then group down until you get to the information uh, that you're interested in. Uh, and again, I can uh, add additional levels to this. And I think in this data set, most of these browsings come from a single host within the network. But uh, you know, quite a common way of pivoting this would be to start off at those high level threat type indicators uh, or a high level threat field, dig down into the individual addresses, and then start to look at who within your organization was actually responsible for that. And you can narrow down uh, to some quite fine green things. Uh, yeah, the other thing that you can do, of course, here is to, at these various levels, start to create meta alerts for those, to merge those together so that you can deal with them as a single instance. And of course, once I'm done with any of these groupings, I can go back to my main view just by clicking that ungroup there, and I'm back to uh, being able to start uh, from the mass of data. And of course, you've also got the interaction between this, you know, the searching at the top, being able to filter stuff down as you have done as source type bro, and then being able to run group buys and so on.